Hello all, welcome in our YouTube channel ERPSAP team. Today we are going to learn how to perform a general entry posting at using FB50 in SAP. Okay, this manual focus on the document posting. General ledger document can be parked by one person, can be posted by another person having the authorization to post the parked documents. The scenario would be applicable when a supervisor wants to approve the document posting. Okay. So what is the uh, in SAP community FB50 is also known as an enjoy transaction. You can you can post any GL entry or voucher posting uh, through FB50 in SAP. So what is the steps? Internet transaction code FB50 in the SAP command field or follow SAP menu path in the next string into the document date, company code, the GL account for debit entry which to be posted to the cost center, debit amount and enter the cost center in which the amount to be posted, the GL account for credit entry, enter the credit amount, okay? Uh, if you follow the SAP menu path, the accounting, uh, go in the accounting, go in the financial accounting, go in the general ledger, go in the posting. If you go for the via transaction code, use the transaction code FB50 in the command field, okay? The document date, posting date, any reference, any header text, okay? Uh, GL account for debit or credit, okay? This type of the screen will be appear, okay? Okay, these are the some uh, data which you should enter in the SAP command window, okay? The cost center, uh, enter the cost center where the expenditure to be credited. Business area, enter the business area. Cost center would be required for the expenditure accounts only. Uh, if the if the cost center would be required for the expenditure accounts only, uh, what is the business area? Bus enter the business area. If the cost center is entered, the business area would be automatically derived. Business area needs to be entered in the all other circumstances. Okay. So ZL account the GL code in SAP GL credit okay so need to enter amount and all all these details okay see uh, this is the document date this is the posting date this is the reference because this is the text is so we have entered here test document header is text okay see the debit GL account is this uh, the amount is this the value date is this and company code business area cost center is this okay and uh, the credit zl is this and value date is this and business area cost center is this you can fill like this okay so once you simulate the document once you simulate the document uh, the washing allowance account is credited with the Washing allowance account is debited with the thousand rupees amount and the secondary and higher education account is credited with the thousand rupees amount. Okay. If all right is this because uh, 784 is credited with thousand rupees and this 105 ZL is debited with thousand rupees. After simulation, uh, if no issue, then you can post the document. And the message will appear the document number has been posted in company code this okay let's do the practicals okay we'll start go in the accounting go in the general ledger go in the posting click on the b50 okay i'm just entering the document date entering the posting date okay ABC test alpha 1 and document header test alpha test charges okay these are purely test document don't take it as a reference okay getting my points so you need to fill here the assignment alpha test charges or anything else okay business area cost center okay profit center you can f you can book the entry uh, with respect to wbs element also okay debit entry is the same amount 10 rupees 1000 
here I am taking the same cost center, okay, but the GL is different. But in your case, the cost center will be different, okay, because uh, you are going to book in one cost center, okay, expenditure. Click on the simulate, okay, the green indicator will take all right documents, okay, see. Uh, the RNM buildings is credited with 10 rupees and uh, repair and maintenance operators and plant is debited with 10 rupees okay this is purely test documents I am just doing this practical for just understanding purpose okay getting my points but once you post the document you have a very real case okay so you can do and post the document accordingly here you have flexibility to save the document to park the document you have to update the taxes also okay so click on the post once you click on the post A GL document has been posted now. Document was posted in the company code double one double zero. Okay. Now you can uh, create a new session. Okay. Go in the GL document. Okay. Go in the GL document. Open FS ten n FS ten n and see the cost center. Uh, the gen fill the general laser account. F go in the dynamic selection. Fill the business area. Save details. Okay, and execute the transaction. Okay, see. In the month of June, the debit amount is ten. Credit uh, credit amount is twenty, and balance is ten. Okay. If you click on this details, see alpha test charges and uh, this see if you open this general laser document then you should uh, seen that RNM operation plant is credited with the same amount and RNM building is debited with same amount okay. getting so after posting the general laser document you should check your document in uh, general laser account posting in the same month or not okay see you can uh, open these document uh, like this okay uh, if I am opening RNM building then 20 rupees is debit in debit entry 10 rupees in credit entry okay See, same in the alpha test charges. See, RNM building is debited with the 10 rupees. 5020801, is credited with 10 rupees. Alpha test charges on this date. So, by doing this, you can understand how can you post the SAP entries in general as okay? SAP document entries in the general laser okay so this is all about uh, how can you post the document using FB50 in SAP and thank you all for watching this video and I have created this video uh, j because of your just basic understanding okay if you have any query regarding this video topic discuss with your senior account officer senior finance official how we if you are new if you are beginner then you should understand uh, these things and discuss these things with your senior finance officer okay thank you all and if you like this video press like and share with your friends share this knowledge with your friends okay 
and uh, still new in our youtube channel please subscribe my youtube channel here psapt and don't forget to press the bell icon okay have a nice day see you in the next video keep smiling bye bye